This Ooh. is cool. Now that is awesome. Top, top of the line. Yeah. Showing and rocking. I made it! I see. <laughs> You're only like 50 minutes late. Well, it's not like I'm looking forward to this or anything. There's no way I was letting Mary get off that easy. So I went out and bought a little locker for little Mary. How much did you pay for this? 110 bucks. <laughs> Oh my God. Okay, I would like to start with the small stuff first. Yeah, that is kind of cool. Look, it's a little TV. Maybe TV like... in a box. At least a $10 monitor. Look, it's a table base. It's pretty cool. Legs, five bucks each, I know. This is trash. Hey! Trash. <laughs> Breaking myself. Kids these days, no work ethic, I tell you. Oh, now this is cool. Hey, the coolest thing we found so far. Hey, pay attention. <laughs> Now, this Ooh. is cool. Now, that is awesome. I already said that. Oh. Hey, remember that three-wheel oh, thing? that goes to, yeah, the wheelie. Why are you taking so long to get it? So we can test, get the three-wheel thing. Man, slow on getting stuff, slow on unloading. Old school Hollywood. We got to figure out what this baby's worth. Look, it has a thingy on it that says Mole Richardson Inc. Hollywood, California. So that we could bet again. Ooh, OK. We'll both guess the price. Loser buys dinner for the winner, the one that gets the closest. I'm always up for friendly wagers. All right, you're first. What is it worth? I'm going to say 1500 bucks. You know what? I won't even look long because I'm, I'm so good at what I do. 2350 Fine. Anywhere the person wants. Fine. Looks like I'll finally get to try that super expensive French restaurant. Hope Ivy likes escargot. The truck will be here in a couple hours. I'm waiting five minutes, and then I'm out of here. We're taking our light to Larry and Michael Parker from Mole Richardson. Apparently, the mole was their grandfather. Obviously, you're, you do lights. So why do you have a stage? Well, this is a teaching facility, and we teach students how to use the lights, how to light a set, and how to be safe. Does this look, look familiar to you? Well, this one here is a Fresnel, manufactured in our factory in 1936. And Fresnel refers to the lens. And the lens, as you see, was designed to make a nice, smooth, even surface for the light uh, when you spot and flooded it. What fits in right here? Does something fit you in You put right your there? barn doors in here, okay. and you can go ahead and do cut your light, barn door the light. Or you can go like this. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> so does this thing work? Let's plug it in. Oh, come on, light work. <laughs> OK, here we go. Watch your eyes, everybody. I call that work. We made a bet on how much this was going to be worth, wow. and whoever was closest has to buy the other one dinner. So, <laughs> how much did you say? I said fifteen hundred. And you said twenty-three fifty. Well, they beautified this by chroming it, so that adds on to the value of it. If it were just sheet metal, it would be more nostalgic. This thing is a classic. I really think it's worth twenty-five now. Uh, you lost. <laughs> I haven't eaten all day in preparation for this, and I'm feeling fancy. No more betting for me with you. Onward that's for sure. light. Now you push this thing about as slow as you race. All right, here we go. What are you going to pay? Saying how much? How much? How much? Hundred dollars. I got one hundred right there. But you do wear. Yeah, yeah. Three, 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 there is no way that locker was getting away from me. This is going to be Leisure World Gold. Nice. But I want to teach you guys one way to find out how long this stuff's really been in there is to look at the date on the newspaper and see just exactly when this stuff was wrapped up. Sunday, December 1991. 20 years. So let's just get some of this stuff out of the way. All right, records. Let's see what kind we got. Miles Davis. Chick Korea, awesome jazz records. The old original Woodstock album. I'm already finding tons of collectible vinyl, and I've only scratched the surface. 
you know what this is? These are made in Germany. This is a Thorin's turntable and they're very sought after. It's all packaged back up in its original packaging. I might have a mint in the box one here. It's never even, yeah. Look at that. Never even been out of the box. This is top, top of the line. Somebody's gonna kill to have this. This stereo equipment is in mint condition. I've gotta go get this checked out. Thank you, Laguna. Let's get that stuff packed up and get to the truck. I spent $2,100 on this locker in Laguna Hills, and I think I totally scored on some old 70s stereo equipment. Hi there. Hey, Howard. Hey, how's it going? Good, I'm Daryl. I'm the one to talk to you on the phone. How you doing? All right, nice to meet you. I got this Thorns here, and was really shocked to see that it was kind of in its original condition. Yeah, this is the... a very rare find. Yeah. And this is quality German engineering, just to show you. You can see that it's dynamically balanced because it's drilled out here as part of the metal. So when they do manufacture it, it dynamically balances for proper speed regulation and low wow and flutter. This sounds like a foreign language to me. But as long as this guy's excited, that's music to my ears. I mean, this is in good condition, right, Howard? It is mint as mint can be. Wait till he sees the speakers. Yeah, the Bozak it was a very good American company back in the 50s and 60s, but you can you can hook them up and give it a listen and spin the vinyl and see what we've got here because Let's do that's that. the ultimate test is how does it sound. That sounded cool. And it was what we say flat, no treble or bass amplified in excess. Let's do this then. The Bozak speakers, the Thorns turntable, what would you pay me for it today? I would say the whole kit and caboodle. Mm -hmm. $1,800. Dollars. Ding! I can move it. You got a deal. I gambled on this locker, and I won. Yowza, baby. All right, we got two units here. Two of them, two times the money. Here we go, number 20. What are you going to pay? Say it. How much? How much? How much? Money? Where? Hundred dollars there, and a two two where? Come on, hundred, hundred and a half. And how about that? One and a quarter, good idea. Hundred and a half, hundred and a half. One fifty there. 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 One Barry's getting a special treatment, but I'm making this old dude pay today. I've got 275 now, three, 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 one more. Three, three there. Would have been 325 now, Barry. All in on three, well, three, all dead. Who are my guess what? Wait, 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 325. Wait, wait, it doesn't matter. Gotta go, guess what? All in on three, well, three, all dead tonight. You in? You know I am. Three and a quarter. Would have been three and a half, Ivy. Ivy is clearly a player. But hey, I like to play too. 350 going once. I've got three and a quarter. One more three time. and a half there. 375 now. I've got 350. You kicked me out? 375, he kicked you the out. 375 and you're out. I got 350. 375 going once. 350. 375 going twice. Just two of them. 375. Two times the money got to go. 375. I'll lay in on three. I'll throw Let me in. Would have been three. Seven, that song machine ain't worth 800 bucks. This is round one. I got 99 more rounds to go. I've got 375 now. 400. 400. 400. 400. 400. 400. 400. Saying no. And I got 375 going once. 400 going twice. I'll lay in on three. Well, three. Well done. Got to go against one night. Sell that your way, Barry. You got it for 375 times two, Barry. I came on my bike, which appears to be a big mistake. I'm gonna have to come back in like an 18-wheeler. I paid $750 for the first two vaults just to make a statement. This one appears to be all books, but let's check it out. Feels like books, too. Unfortunately, nothing really in here that's old enough. Hope these things are worth something, because I am not finding much. well-made chair. Well, I got one of these mid-century chairs. Yeah. So we ended up with four of these mid-century matching chairs. Yeah, he's got to be worth $300 to $400 for just the four of them. I'd say the rocking chair, and actually, it's a, it's a pretty good one. It's got to be 100 bucks. Yeah, so I want to spend my nights sewing and rocking. Yeah. Here we go! Yeah. Yeah. 
I may not have a lot of friends, but I got a lot of money. King of the world!